Okay, so I've removed the CPU and the battery. If you can and you've got the know-how, I'll take the PCM CIA slots off because where I've cooked it before, the buttons are melted and don't move. So that's something I would do if I could, but I haven't got the knowledge or the know-how to do that myself. I've cleaned the thermal compound off of the, I think that's the North Bridge and the graphics chip. This is the NVIDIA G84 on this one. And I've used Arctic Clean stuff because I use Arctic Silver on the heat sink and compound stuff. Uh, ignore this wire because that's what I use to keep my fan running at full speed all the time, which hasn't helped with the problem. I would also advise taking this wire off of here, but I can't do that because my plug's broke. So, yeah, this is going to be the fourth time I've cooked it. So the last three times have worked, and I'm hoping this time works too. So yeah, I'll let you know how I get on. Okay, so I've cooked it in there. It's partially put back together. Put my CPU back on there, all cleaned up, ready to be put back together. Put my battery back on. It smells a bit dodgy, as it always does after you've cooked it, but hopefully it's going to work. So, yeah. Speak soon. Right, so after its fourth time of being cooked, see what happens now. There you go. Yep, so it seems to have worked. So I put it in the oven at 180 degrees Celsius for 10 minutes and then bring it back out. So yeah, hope it works for you.